This is NHSN Live with your news and morning announcements with Tyler Aaron. Your papermaker sports coverage with Hayden Caberly and Paul Kennedy. Your weather coverage with Josiah Milkey, produced by Hudson Goodwin. Good morning, NHS staff and students. Today is Friday, November 2nd. We start today off talking about the recent Trump rally in Mosinee, Wisconsin. Last Wednesday, Trump visited the town of Mosinee. It was said that there was over 1,000 people at the rally. During the rally, Trump talked about a new era of civility in politics. He said, quote, Those in the political arena must stop treating political opponents as being morally defective. Trump also made attacks against fake news. Furthermore, Trump helped boost Governor Scott Walker's campaign and also further Wisconsin Republican representative views. Now on to Paul Edward Ronald Kennedy with sport. We would like to congratulate Mr. Gemrick for becoming the head coach here at Nakusa for this year's basketball season. So the NHSM team interviewed him to see how he feels about the upcoming season. I am very excited to be the head coach this year, leading up to the basketball season in a couple weeks. Uh, I have a great core of seniors that have been playing together since fourth and fifth grade that are looking to lead the team this year. Also, there's some young talent coming up that'll uh, complement those guys uh, on the varsity team very well. Looking ahead at the teams that we're playing this year, I feel very confident that we're going to get numerous wins. We should definitely split or beat some of those teams both games or both times that we play them. Team chemistry this year, just watching the kids over the summer and so far at open gyms, it seems like they work very well together and I'm looking forward to having a great season this year. Thank you, Mr. Gemrick, and good luck to the boys' basketball team this season. Now on to JJ with the weather forecast. Thanks, Paul. Here's our almanac for today. We have a high of 45, and our average was 49, and our record was 75. We won't get anywhere near that, and that was back in 1924. If we take a look at our 6- to 10-day temperature outlook and precipitation outlook, for, for temperature, will be average to a little below average for the next week or so. And for precipitation, we will be above average. Let's take a look at our three-day Nakusa weather outlook. And as you can see, Saturday, mostly cloudy, and there'll be more clouds moving in the afternoon, high of 47. Sunday, it'll be mostly rainy all day, but that's all right. We'll get an extra hour of sleep, because that's the end of daylight savings time. So don't forget to push back your clocks one hour. And Monday, Mostly cloudy with a high of 47. Have a great weekend, everyone. Let's send it to Paul for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. For lunch menu choices today, we have classic cafe with the lasagna roll-up with sauce and a Caesar salad plus garlic toast. For the pizza station, we have a pepperoni pizza and a cheese pizza. For a grab and go, we have a ham and deli sandwich. For the dinner station, it is a cheeseburger and popcorn and chicken. For the creation station, we have build your own taco bar. Happy birthday today goes out to Isabella Wood. Um, Friday and Saturday, we have FBLA Nation Fall Conference in Chicago, Illinois. And then Sunday, we have the, girl, the girls' basketball season starts. Attention football players, your award banquet is Sunday, November 11th at the Nakusa Community Center starting at 5.30 p.m. Dinner will be provided for the student athlete and parents. Awards will follow the meal. Baseball players meeting Wednesday, November 14th, 2 o'clock at the Commons. Baseball parents meet and greet Wednesday, November 14th, 5 o'clock at the Commons. Students, just as a reminder, that the collection of Operation Christmas Child boxes is at the end of this week. The grade that creates the most boxes will get a prize. Please talk to your advisor for more information needed. Thank you and have a great day.